Okay, Adam. Um, three one win here at Bonga. Um, obviously, delayed twenty four hours. Didn't seem to affect the team. I thought for, for the first sort of fifteen minutes was a bit slow, and then we we got into gear. No, yeah, I, I agree. I definitely sort of got going really for the first half hour. Didn't find our stride, and I thought first half we wanted to go forward with the ball. Just didn't find our stride. Yeah, I thought we were going to get forward too early and try to score every time we got the ball. Uh, but yeah, the last ten fifteen minutes of the first half and. You know, the whole of the second half, I thought it was a very good performance. We didn't really let them out of their half, and um, you know, on another day, we'd probably be disappointed that we didn't get more goals. Okay, so the 24-hour delay did it, did it have much of an f- effect on on the mayor's pl- uh, mindset or anything? No, if anything, it gave us a chance to be more prepared. Um, we've got the lads in yesterday, and you know, I just like to say. You know how professional they are to do that. You know, give up their time. I know some of them were on their way in, but you know, for them to come in and train, there was a full, um, you know, 22 players turned up for training. Um, you know, day before game, it's an extra session. They don't get any extra money for doing that, and give up their time and effort. And uh, I'm glad they got their rewards today because they are a real professional, professional group, and they work really hard. So I'm glad they got their reward today. Okay, I'm um, new signing Beresford. Um, played the game today, uh, looked look really lively, dangerous. Pleased with what you saw from him? No, yeah, definitely. I think um, you know he's a really, really good player. He's comfortable on the ball, um, good defender, a bit more of a fullback um, than a winger, but you know done well going forward. Um, so I think yeah, what, what a place, to, what a, what a day to to make your debut, um, and I thought he's done really well. And um, hopefully, you know, really pleased with the. Uh, um, Recruiting that we've done there, him and Luke. Um, you know, I think they're both, both, both really well for what we've got already. Okay, um, Ollie Pierce, another, another brace for him today. Uh, for, you know, puts him on 20, 21 goals for the season. He, he's, he's been a real important linchpin for this team this season so far. No, he certainly has, yeah. Um, I think he'll even be disappointed that he hasn't got more goals, to be honest. Um, you know, but they're massive, aren't they? Uh, I think that's. Two goals he's got now in consecutive game for a few a few games on the belts now, and um, yeah, he's, I'm, I'm glad because he's, he's really working hard this season. He's uh, we're asking him to press high, and you know it's probably not something that he wants to do. Um, but you know when he's, he's he's at it and he's working hard, I think it brings out the best in him, and I'm just glad he's getting his rewards because you know he's a, he's a top top player at this level. Okay, obviously. Th- th- Go, going one nil down, what, what, what wasn't I do? Well, Harrison was stuck in two minds whether to come or come or come or stay, and he he got to the edge of the box and decided he, sh- he should go back. Um, so that that was obviously the, the only downside on the day. I thought I thought really limited their chances. No, yeah, I don't I don't think they had too many chances. Disappointed with the goal. I thought it was a, a cheap one to give away. Um, but again, the lads responded really well, and glad Cal got the goal before half time. I think they settled us down a little bit. Um, but yes, we've got to be better to deal with that sort of situation. I think Aaron and Harrison both of them got caught in two minds. Um, so yeah, we've, we've got, to, got to deal with that better. Disappointment not to come over clean sheet. Um, you know, it's important we've got to start um, being better defensively um, in the last half of the season. But you know, we're halfway through the season. That's all. Um, really pleased with the points tally we got halfway through. Still, be disappointed. I think we should be possibly six points better. Um, but that's not the strike for in the second half of the season. Yeah, um, New Year's Day, Horsham, another local derby, but a home this one. Um, obviously, a bit of rest, a uh, couple of training sessions, or just probably the one Thursday? Yeah, we just train Thursday now, um, see how everybody's, you know, this pitch with the took a lot out of it, it was wet, um, you know, especially on that far side, so the legs will be heavy, so it's important that we get the boys recovered and, and see who needs to get a little rest in before another game on Monday. So, you know, the full squad, I think we've got 19 players to choose from. Um, Jesse and Ollie are missing through illness um, today, so we've got them to come back in as well. So, yeah, we'll see how everybody's doing. And we've got two massive games now to look forward to over the weekend. OK, so con- congratulations for today, and we'll see you New see Year's you Day. New Year, Happy New Year. And Happy New yeah. Year, mate. Good to see everybody on first. <laughs>